And coach, now the uh, fall season has wrapped. A really strong close for you guys. Yep. And let's start with kind of the last tournament over at Arkansas State. Uh, kind of a weather shortened tournament. You dealt with the elements a little bit, but uh, still had a really solid first round, all things considered. And uh, was even to do better with some better conditions uh, as the as the tournament closed. Yeah, I mean we had an emphasis uh, uh, to get get off to a good start because most of the fall we we'd had some shaky starts and finished well. So a uh, point of emphasis was certainly to get off to a good start, and the guys did that. And talking about the guys, and first of all, let's talk about Michael and his first tournament, and uh, he showed really well, especially yeah, with uh, dealing with some tough conditions. Yeah, Michael got in the lineup, uh, and you know, you're never sure what's going to happen, but he uh, he came through pretty well. I was really pleased with his. Uh, he's been working really hard uh, all semester, and it's really nice to see him get in there and have an impact. And then Eric was just a model of consistency throughout yeah. the month of October. He had yeah. uh, one tournament where he got off to a rocky start over at HBU, but he really regathered himself in three top ten finishes, uh, including a second over at Chicago where it was the toughest course for you guys. So yeah, absolutely. I mean, he's been great. Uh, a little problem, a little swing uh, issue in his first tournament. We, we, we made that real small adjustment in his, in his uh, swing, and since then he's been, he's been doing great. And up in Chicago, that was phenomenal because those wins were up there. To shoot what he did, that was pretty solid. And the team finishes as well, obviously very encouraging. You've, you've played some uh, a couple of schools within your own conference, uh, been able to finish ahead of a couple of them as well, and just the overall scope of competition that you guys got and kind of uh, what the emphasis was with this fall schedule. Well, I mean, you know, you go into it just hoping that we're going to uh, come together as a team. And, and early on it wasn't so much the case, but we had some good individual performances. At Houston, I think Sami finished, Sami Vani finished uh, fifth, and I believe Marcus Krieger uh, finished sixth, and in the next tournament, Eric got rolling uh, for for the rest of the season, and then in the even in the final event, uh, uh, Greg Palmer uh, had a top ten. He was tied for eighth with Eric. So it was nice to see those individual performances in each of our tournaments, and and the last two tournaments, I think we really came together as a team. That was really nice. And that's been the thing as well. Uh, like you said, everybody's had their great individual moments, but it's just a matter of being able to put it all together uh, for the team performances as you turn forward to the Yeah, spring. absolutely. I mean, I think if we can uh, if we get productivity out of at least four of the guys and get off to a good start, I think uh, it's a good sign for the future, I think. I'm looking forward to the, to the spring with these guys. We've got some things to work on in the off season, and hopefully uh, we'll get on top of it. And uh, can't wait to get it started at, uh, at Nichols in, in February. And... As you look forward to the spring schedule, and you mentioned starting with Nichols, uh, uh, some of the courses that you see, some familiarity, uh, but just the overall, um, just the overall concept of look, looking ahead to the spring schedule well, I and think, the competition. I think anytime you've got familiarity with a course, uh, that makes it a little bit easier. You certainly know where not to hit it, and and uh, a couple times this semester we ran into that, uh, uh, where you know I think we're at a little bit of disadvantage when, when it's a new course for us, and, and the teams that are there are there every year. Uh, in the spring, uh, we're going to have a few new ones, but at Nichols and, uh, and I believe Arkansas State, we're familiar with those.